today I have a special guest. Ta -da. This guy right here. Big. Thicker than a snicker. Thicker than a snicker. <laughs> Damn, I don't want to be a play. I don't wanna be a play. Damn, I don't wanna be a play. I just want you to wine slow on me like a Jamaican. I'm addicted to bad bitches like I never had bitches. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Graves, forever should be yours. Oh, hit him with the oh, hit him with the dad. Ready, Josh? Dad. <laughs> so for today's video, I have a special guest. Introduce yourself. Donald Trump, not support this message. Just kidding, I'd never be that racist fucker. I don't know, what's with everybody who comes on my channel that just don't want to introduce themselves as their real name? But he's in my, on my channel now. I told you guys he was going to make an appearance. So for today's video, we're going to be doing the friend tag. So you guys are going to get to know a little more about our friendship. Yeah! Okay, so first question. Full name. His name is Joshua John Sheeler. Can I use your actual real name? Yeah, you can use my actual name. <laughs> I'll just go with Grace or Oreo Faye Babatunda. Alright. Um, our zodiac sign, he is a Capricorn. <laughs> what am I, Josh? I'm gonna guess. Um... An Aquarius? Nope. I am a Gemini. Favorite animal? I just like Sage. <laughs> Animal. Your favorite animal? A fish? No. <laughs> Cause I have a pet fish. Yeah. yeah. What's his name? Freckles. Freckles. No clue what your favorite animal would be. His favorite animal, I think, is a dog. Am I right? Yeah, probably. Exactly. But Grace don't have a favorite animal. Actually, so um, favorite food. His favorite food is pizza. Her favorite food is anything chicken. That's true. Fried curry. Chicken. Mm -hmm. Favorite color. His favorite color is green. Her favorite color is blue. Yeah. Um, favorite thing to do. His favorite thing to do is probably, if it's not play volleyball, it'll be just relax and watch shows. I'll just watch TV shows in general. You like to chill. No Netflix, but chill. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um. You just like to have fun, honestly. Anything that's fun. Yeah, cause you know your girl over here crazy, crazy. Okay, not like that, but crazy. <laughs> um, <laughs> favorite season? I think favorite season is your summer. Summer, yeah. Yeah. Summer. His will probably be summer too. Yeah. But like in the winter, he likes. He doesn't like the cold, but he likes snow, cause it's so pretty and whatnot. Um, Who takes longer to get ready? You for sure. Yeah, definitely me. <laughs> I will say me because he doesn't take that long to get ready. And especially in Chadron, I don't really care. <laughs> Let's go. Um, um, dream vacation. His dream vacation would probably be Jamaica because he's, he. I don't know, lately he just wants to go to Jamaica and get his tan on. He just wants a, you know, a nice fresh summer tan. But yeah, a glow, summer glow. Uh, yours would be Bora Bora. Mm hmm the beach. Bora Bora, the beach. The beach. Yeah, what would okay. your dream job? His dream job would be to be a sports psychology, psych, psych, psychologist. psychologist, psychologist, a sports psychologist, or a co athlete, a coach, a athletic coach, or something that has to do with athletes, especially volleyball. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, yours would be. The CEO of a foundation, mm -hmm. probably UNICEF. Mm -hmm. um, favorite artist, his favorite artist is Adele. And yeah. Her favorite is Bryson Tiller. Yeah. No surprise. Um, birthday. His birthday is January 5th, okay? Because he's a Capricorn. When's my birthday? When's my birthday, Josh? June 17th. Okay. Um, 1904. 1904. <laughs> We're on future goals. Uh, his future goal is probably to have a great job, drive a Mercedes Benz, you know, the wit wit, um, have a beautiful wife and lovely kids. I'm probably gonna be his beautiful wife, but oh well. <laughs> and have beautiful light skin mixed kids. Or a baby mama. Or a baby mama. Side either one chick. works well. Okay, <laughs> not the side chick, but either one works well. <laughs> You want to, future goal would be graduate college. Mm -hmm. um, you want to have a successful career. Mm -hmm. 
again, UNICEF, CEO, and you want to have a family and kids as well. Yeah, and you have to tell them how tall does my husband have to be? No shorter than 6'5". See? They already know. I love them. My friends already know. Um, favorite yeah. athlete? That's hard. Yeah. Cat Bell. That's your favorite athlete. Am I right? Yep. Yeah. Um, I don't know. My favorite athlete ever, hands down, would be Derrick Rose. And people would be like, why? He's always injured. Y'all notice this guy is always injured and when he comes back, he bounces back hella nice. But he never gives up. He never ever gives up. And he's always on his grind. So I feel like maybe that's probably why he's one of my favorite athletes. One of my favorite. But like most of my favorite athletes, like in my life that I that are like that I know personally will probably be some of my trap friends or my basketball friends. Talent of the other. I'ma tell you one talent y'all probably know he can do. But over here can do hair. He can do braids, he can do crochet, he can even sew your little weave and whatnot. <laughs> but yeah. I'm gonna just flip my hair because you know he did a little one-two job, but yeah, he can do hair. That is secret talent that people did not know. He can do hair and he's wicked good at volleyball. People probably don't know that either, but yeah, those are talents that he has. Your talent would be makeup. Uh -huh. Um, you're very athletic. Y'all see? See the guns? It's there. It's there. It's, it's <laughs> <laughs> It's there. Um, and then you just, you're crafty. Like, you can do anything. Boom. Wifey material people. Boom. Okay. You like the most about the other. Uh, what I like the most about him is he keeps it real, you know? Like, he does not beat around the bush. If he has something to say, he gonna say it. He don't care if your feelings, if you find it being your feelings or your feelings find be hurt. He don't give two fucks. He gonna tell you how it is. But yeah, I think that's one thing I really like about him, that he's honest with you and he's always there when you need him. Even though you go MIA, which I do like for years, and then I come back, he's always there when I need him. So, shout out to you, you know? That's one thing I think I like the most about him. And he's kind of funny. Kind of kind funny. Of. You, I would say, is more of a quality. Um, when it comes to like, you having an issue or a problem or something, or needing advice, you take advice. Most people nowadays just want the glory of somebody telling them or complaining or hearing their problems to sound popular or anything along the lines of that. But when you actually ask for advice, like you take it and you want to learn, you want to grow, you want to become a better person and you really value and input from other people. And that just kind of shows like the type of friend that you are. Aww, that's so cute. <laughs> so anyways, thank you for coming to my channel. No problem. And that is all for our tag. I hope you guys did get to know a little bit about one of my best friends right here, Mr. Donald Trump. Hashtag. Hashtag Donald Trump. Don't vote for him. No. But <laughs> I can't even vote because I'm not even a citizen of this country, but who am I to talk? <laughs> but thank you for coming on my channel once again. And I hope you guys do like the video. Remember, share the video, like the video, subscribe to my channel. What do you got to do? Share the video, like the video, and, and subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. And everything for my social media, I'll leave the links below. And so for his, I'll leave the link below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Hit him with a dab. Duh.